Welcome back to the Amy Kardashian and the Expert Show, where we bring some of the top experts in the world to help you transform your business and personal life. And sometimes we bring inspirational stories to touch your heart and help you see your life in a different perspective. I am your host, Amy Kardashian, not, not Kardashian. Kardashian. <laughs> and I am your co-host, Stephanie Thompson. I'm a classically trained singer-songwriter. In this episode, we've been learning about living your artistic dream, becoming a storyteller, and in this segment, this is the third of four segments, we are going to learn about, I'm a storyteller, now what? Yeah. With Ren and Corinne's eyes. So now, now what? what? <laughs> wow, okay. Now what? <laughs> I don't understand why I have to sit in this room and not be able to get out and sing and listen and watch the moonlight like you. <laughs> I keep your picture inside my bed. Woo! That's why I love you. I love you. Okay, so now we can sing and act. Now what? <laughs> now okay, what? Okay, okay. Um, <laughs> Okay, here's the fun part. Okay, we're starting out. We've gotten ready. Wow, I got an idea. I don't know, but I can't get a job. You know, plus I got to have a job to pay the bills. We got all this stuff going on. Yeah. What do we do? Okay, well, you know, you're in a group now. You're probably in groups, and they're all learning to be actors and singers. And you got this group of people. The most silliest thing to me in this day and age it happens all the time. Is well. All my friends are actors, and we're just not getting jobs. Well, how many you got? How many of you can act? Well, about ten of us. Yeah. Okay, that's not, a, it's ridiculous. A, uh, one of the first things I got to do in my life, which was kind of fun, was be in circuses and see a circus troupe. If you've got 10 or even five other actors, let me tell you, you have, the, lar the bottom line isn't, well, I got to get on a movie or I got to get on a television he station. He grabs you, right? <laughs> so <laughs> so <laughs> the simple <laughs> fact is, yeah. let me be clear with you here on this. Okay. Who pays the bills of every record out there, every movie, every television show? No, yeah, we think it's the advertisers, but let me be clear, it's you, yeah. the audience. Yes. Oh, okay, but I, I don't own a television station. Really? The internet is 4.5 billion people a day in motion, the largest city in history. You got five actors, listen, one of you pick up a camera mm -hmm. and an start learning. Now. One of you get into story writing up, Joseph Vogel. Don't tell me that's not motivation yeah. right there. So right there. <laughs> jo uh, Joseph, that is motivation. And it runs. Yeah, yeah. And you got uh, Vogel, who studied under Joseph Campbell. And there's a great book out there uh, called The Writer's Journey. One of you start learning how to write. Grab a program off the internet. There are many of them out there. Write something. Film it. Get started. Get it out there. You now, you can either go YouTube. in with a headshot or maybe you could go in with a web series. Who do you think is going to get the job more when it mm. comes to acting? Okay. Oh, by the way, that works with singers, too. It does, because guess what? Tell them a little bit about songwriting, by the way. She won an award in LA as one of the top songwriters, so Yay! this is kind of cool. <laughs> Thank you. Stephanie's a great songwriter, too, and so are you. We write together. Um, well, uh, today, there's tons of information out there about songwriting. Tons. You can grab a book, you can go on YouTube and get some information about that, about how to write. It's, if you have a Macintosh, you have GarageBand. You can yeah. record. It costs like 100 bucks. For a microphone you know what you don't have that then just get a cheap one anywhere mm -hmm. you can do that just start just I start want people to use just their phones something. right yeah, you can use your iPhone you can, use your iPhone. You can go get royalty free music mm -hmm. off of iTunes oh, or off of the right. internet iTunes 99 cents you got your music because you're going well I'm not a musician who cares pay 99 cents put it in your computer and garage band and sing guess what you've got product mm -hmm. and we're going to talk about that in the next segment today's it's different than back in the day when we started right. like yeah four or five years ago just saying um, <laughs> now technology is caught up it has. and and you can you can sing you can record you can, you can and film, to be honest can, yeah when we started we were in uh, a postgraduate music school um called dick rose uh, school of music and I that went there only a couple years ago. Yeah, yeah just yeah. a couple years ago. <laughs> so, That's it. Uh, we went to that really quickly um, because I had a problem as a stage person trying to talk to musicians. I realized they have a language. So I thought, 
as I always did, well, what's the best school to go to? And they said, well, this is only where people who've been in music go to. So I thought, well, I'll just go for three months. So we went. I stayed for three years, learned how to write for orchestras. But I'm a fanatic. Uh, so with <laughs> that so in crazy. mind, though, he is right. The world then allowed you to come home and record, if you trained well, mm -hmm. a million dollar product. Guess what, actors? You now are there. There are cameras out there that can shoot television phone. quality yes. for around 800 to $600. Take a look at Black Magic Design, you'll see that. Now one of you is going to have to learn how to edit. Now that means music, somebody's got to do sound, and that can't hurt. Yeah. So easy, get your friends easy. involved. Easy. That's how it works. Turn into a troupe, right. create a product, and then when people say, well what have you done, here's your headshot, you have stuff on the web, and let's say you got maybe about 250, 500,000 people. Who do you think you're going to take? The person they don't know at the audition or the person who already comes with an audience? Mm. Keep it in mind. Yes. <laughs> That's very really important. Fan base, very yeah. important in show business or performing arts and at now, all. Now, these days, right? Yeah. I mean, yes. Yeah. Ten yes. years ago, that was not even a question. Not even a question. Yeah, yeah. they don't know who you are, they accept it. But now they want you to do the work, and they want that's to know right. you have followers. Yes, yes. That, that's true. And this if you don't is, have followers, they won't how many forget. followers? First thing, how many followers you have? That's right. That's you usually right. ask, it starts your at a quarter value of a million is with your now. followers. A quarter mm. for the labels, for the record labels. Labels require yeah. a quarter of a million and followers. You, you have to have a quarter of a million followers, at least 100,000 sales. To even talk to you. To even talk to you. You're self-releasing, yeah. like on iTunes or whatever. It, it doesn't have to be an album. It can be a single. Mm. But to even as talk to you. As long as you have followers. That's true. That's all And that just so you'll know, for those of you who wonder, you do not have to go with the record companies all the time They're anymore. Self-releasing. There are people out there. You can self-produce. Uh, there was a girl that Justin Timberlake brought in the business. She had 500 million viewers. Wow. You know what happened on her first day of selling her single? <laughs> what? Yeah. She became an instant multi-multi-millionaire. But the product was good enough. Mm. You can do this at home. You can do it, friends. Now, if you can and you guys can put the money together, of course, get to a professional recording studio. Right, of course. Or go to the local college, check it out. There's going to be people that are into film and stuff. Student but you know films. what they don't always have? For some reason, a lot of times, yeah. they don't have actors. They don't. And it's they're so actually weird. looking for you, but mm. they don't know where to look. It, and, it, and they don't always have screenwriters either. Oh, that's another thing. They so don't. so yeah, do, you think, do you think they don't know where the actors, because people, they don't uh, uh, go pro, they don't want to go in that road because they think it's too hard. Yes. It's very hard to get to, to act. It's too much competition. Why should I even start? I have family to feed. I have to future. Or families say, well, you go get your job. So you think a lot of people probably not even taking that step because mm. they're afraid? Most Phenomenal definitely. question. Great and question. she's right there because the you fact is, guess what? Reality? I want to be an actor put, then. Put, <laughs> you can put food on the table. Coach me. But let I me, want you to coach it me won't now. Be hard. <laughs> let me be You'd clear be with you. Too. If your life is about nine to five, then basically you are living to eat. Yeah. If you should find an art form, I don't care whether it's painting, photography, something. See, anything. Because it gives you a balance in your life that can't be described in yeah. a normal way. And let's be honest, if you wonder what our more evolved self is as humans, how many other part of the animal kingdom on this planet have you ever seen painting, drawing, photos, film, recording? So guess what? It's an evolved part of us. It allows us to see things, develop and grow, creativity, and right? solutions. Wow. It just takes Beautiful. you to a different mm -hmm. place. Yeah, it and does. And I think that's why either scary or you live in it. Exactly. Exactly. So pay the bills. Right? And how do you do all that? Be here now. Mm -hmm. I'm at my job. Be totally here. But you know, I'm at entertainment. Be totally here. Isn't that here. something? If you stop and think about it, people who want to be actors, singers, or speakers, mm -hmm. you see them, they don't give up easy. You can't no, give up. No. You know, <laughs> I, I'm just getting it now because yeah. there is something special yes. about that feeling. Like there is something special yeah. when I speak to people because yes. I feel like I'm living by yeah. sharing and help them live. Yes. yes. So I feel living. Yeah. That's and what storytellers do. And then I just give them do. inspiration. We share. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then also Stephanie, she <laughs> loves to be on the stage. Yeah. Why? <laughs> because she feels she <laughs> inspires so them. Yeah. And she gives them entertainment. So, and when you get to that feeling, you can't replace it with anything. 
When you nice. have the ability to touch people's lives, yeah. Yeah. there's just no... It's, and you feel just, it. You just yeah, live it. You it's, don't give up fun. on it. So that's why it's yeah. very hard to give up on it. We're but meant to be It's very hard right, right now to yeah. give up on this session and then this segment because know, we have to We're not. It's go. not long enough. I no. know. We don't have enough time. We'll be back to with <laughs> yeah. her webinar. She comes see that. But stay tuned. I had a question, too, but maybe we can talk address it on that segment. That sounds perfect. We're going to be talking about serving story that serves the audience Perfect. on the next segment. Yes. So. Serving the story that serves the audience. So if you're watching live right now, perfect. Stay with us. If you're not watching live, you could you could rewatch the whole show on AK and the experts.com. Stay tuned with us. We'll be right back.